Mic check. One, two, one, two. All right. So this just further confirms I'm not doing WWE for the rest of the day. Get back at it tomorrow. So tomorrow I'm going to get back at it doing the Extreme Rules pay-per-view for the NXT roster. Because literally just in one minute ago, I did the exact same thing I did earlier and accidentally hit the options button when I was trying to go over here and hit the share button and I was using I didn't have both hands on the controller because my other hand was touching my laptop because I was trying to get ready to set up the stream to record it and when I was trying to do like a DJ thing trying to do something with both hands and so automatically right hand touch the right button instead of the left button on the controller and this did not come out the way I wanted it to like Raw did for the most part I did want Miz to be Cole Quinn it's just a squash match for him to you know get back onto the winning side uh, this next match it was actually really supposed to be Bo Dallas was supposed to get the win over Shane Thorne uh, right here um, we're going to have a setup match. And Tony Storm winning. That's fine with that right there. I hadn't really even decided. I was going to like decide right when the loading screen was starting <laughs> on who was going to win that match. I hadn't decided yet. Uh, X-Pac beating uh, Tony Nese and Mike Kanellis in the handicap match. That was supposed to happen. Uh, Zelina Vega being called out by Sonya Deville because recognizing that Sonya Deville... I mean, I'm sorry, recognizing that Zelina Vega was trying to interfere in the match last week between Matt Riddle and Andrade. So Sonya Deville uh, called her out, and then they had a match. Uh, I was actually thinking I was going to have Sonya win this one, but they probably did the right thing by having Zelina win this one. Uh, I just didn't want, I, I, my mind was really on, I didn't want Sonya to come in and lose two matches. In a you know in a row because she lost to Tony Storm last week, um, which allowed Tony Storm to be the number one contender now for the SmackDown Women's Title. So that's why I was thinking I was gonna go with Sonya, but I guess it kind of works out with Zelina um, winning this one for right now, and we still have one more show before uh, Clash of Champions. And then here in the main event, this was not supposed to happen. Rey Mysterio, Shelton, and Aleister Black were supposed to defeat the team of Davari, Kendrick, who are actually the tag team, as you know, and Buddy Murphy, but it somehow led Davari beat Rey Mysterio, probably because Rey Mysterio was on, uh, well, no, because Rey Mysterio won. So, ah, man, not saying Rey Mysterio won before, so he, I was like, maybe they going with like a, he's on a losing streak kind of thing, but now nah, he actually won a match. Um, last week so yeah like three of these matches didn't go half of the show didn't go the way I wanted it to go that match <coughs> excuse me well at least two of the matches didn't go the way I was planning for them to go um, so ah, this damn game these controls I, again I don't get it why do they have an instant simulate button instead of it saying are you sure you want to simulate they have an instant simulate button and then also it's saying like you know the triangle button like if you go over here and like let's say like if you go to calendar right here triangle is to edit right let's go look at the news real quick what's on the news oh that's right that was from um, NXT and but if you go over here and you go to like tag teams if you press triangle it deletes that's dumb as hell why wouldn't that be the edit over here as, as well and so many times I hit it on accident I'm like oh wait dang it X is the edit on this one not triangle 
that's the same way it should be with the options button instead of it just instantly doing simulate it should be a pop up first that says are you sure you want to simulate <sighs> alright man so again get back at it tomorrow extreme rules pay per view will be the first thing I do uh, early in the day and then I'll probably get through the rest of these shows it's already after 9 o'clock at night I need to get off here anyway I had a long day had a late start and a long day. Now I miss wrestling two shows because of that damn button. I'm going to try to get Clash of Champions wrapped up by the end of tomorrow night, which will be Thursday. And then we get ready to go into the weekend. College football and pro football and stuff. Ah. Alright, so sorry. Again, no matches that you're going to get to see from SmackDown Live. <laughs> Golly damn ah the programming for this damn game <laughs>